Gaming, and this is Assassin's Creed Origins gameplay. Hey, this is Damian Nash here with Rectify Gaming. We are looking at gameplay footage from PAX West 2017 of Assassin's Creed Origins. Played on an Xbox dev kit. Xbox One dev kit. The graphics are beautiful. The gameplay is smooth. There was a little bit of differences going on here. And the person who's playing is none other than Phantom X7X. My son and fellow Rectify Gaming writer. Phantom, tell me some of the stuff that you noticed about the gameplay within Assassin's Creed Origins. Um, first thing I noticed right off the bat is that it was way harder to control, especially when I just got on the horse, which is why you see me running into the, all the rocks in the beginning on the horse and jumping off and everything. Uh, just the sensitivity is way up, as I also noticed. And when you saw me hitting the wall, it's because I was used to the last games where it was right trigger and A to run up and free run up things. And now it's just, you just kind of move forward at something and you really just find it, which, is, which I thought was pretty weird. But these are all things, that, now I got a chance to play this during the press hour. And these are all things that once you get it out of your head about the old Assassin's Creed games and you get in more into the motion that this is something new, but it's not so new. If you're a fan of Ubisoft games and you play games like, I'm just going to straight up say, Ghost Recon, the most recent one, Wildlands, you're going to feel at home playing this Assassin's Creed game because you can utilize tools where you can call things up just like you can call up uh, Sinew, which is your falcon. Your falcon plays a key part in your mission play and exploration. You can see it right now. Now, Sinew also basically is a drone. It's like the drone from Wildlands. You mark your targets, puts up a little blip on your screen, allows you to know where to travel. And traveling is something you're going to be doing a lot in this game because it's such a big and vast open world. Now, Phantom, you're a huge fan of Assassin's Creed, correct? Uh, yeah. And one of the things in the Assassin's Creed games is, is that you can't often, you can get in the water, but you can't go often explore the water, correct? Uh, yeah, you can usually just only dive, but it doesn't give you a whole view of underwater. It's usually just for sneaking, and that was about it. Now, in this footage, we are seeing you actually explore underwater. Uh, can you tell me how that felt for the first time in Assassin's Creed, being able to do that? Well, it felt similar to Black Flag when you do the little anchor dives. To, you know to collect the loot and stuff but being able to do it without you know any um any part any small mission anything like that was actually really cool because that probably means there's going to be a lot of you know things to do underwater yeah the freedom of exploration is something that a lot of people look for in in these open world games and assassin's creed origin is looking to give you exactly that they're looking to give you the freedom be able to explore the way you want, to do the missions the way you want. You're the assassin. You're the skilled killer. You do it your way. So for Phantom X7X, and me, Damian Nash, and all of Rectify Gaming, we're going to check out now. Stay tuned for more content from PAX West 2017. I think, but you already got one.
Yeah, I need one. Yeah, I got one. 